It's one thing to pick a favorite in your bracket. It's another thing to bet them against the spread. Who do you really trust? And as a heads up, if you want full bets, projections, and a Discord chat for March Madness, go over to ftnbets.com, grab the NCAA package, use code MAYO for that sweet, sweet discount. But enough of that. This is Mayo's Triple Play, Bet on Favorites. Grand Canyon does one thing really well, and that's rebound. That's great. It really is. Rebounding so important. But there aren't many Luke Garzas in the whack, so I don't see their one strength being much of a strength in this one. The Hawkeyes have 14 wins by 15 or more points this season. And they're gonna make it 15 when they cover the 14 and a half on Saturday. This is just a simple mismatch for Florida State. The Seminoles have the tallest roster in the country, and when you bring Scotty Barnes finding his footing down the stretch into play, it's tough to imagine the Spartans being too much of an issue. Take the minus 10 and a half over UNC Greenboro. The Ducks are coming off a loss, and that's good. Following their last loss, there was a six-game winning streak. Before that loss, five in a row. Oregon's an experienced group that has proven plenty capable of taking care of the ball. So don't expect VCU's pressure to pose much of a problem. Ducks, minus five and a half over the 10th seeded VCU. 